And even say, go and be fierce. I can't mark you. Pastor. 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 Well, that's right. Hey, I said to judge them, we're going to take the same choice. That's right. That's right. Let judge be wrong. In verse 14. This is what it says, verse 13. Thank the Lord. This is what happened before Ezekiel saw this vision he just read. He said unto me again, Turn thee yet again, and thou shalt see greater abomination that they do. What God had done is taken Ezekiel and given him a vision and a picture of these people's hearts. See, he couldn't see what was going on in the inside. So he took Ezekiel up in the spirit and gave him a vision of these people's hearts. And when we come down there, he said, Then he brought me to the door of the gate of the Lord's house, which was toward the north. And behold, there sat women weeping for Tamar. Now these folks are weeping too. But they're not weeping for the right thing. And that's what set them apart. Everybody just about going on and weeping. But the problem is what you weeping for. What are you weeping about? Oh, well, that's right. Come on. Some folks are weeping for God. Some people are weeping about God. Oh, Lord. It's, it's a hard. I don't know like good like this. I'd stay down there. I'd stay over in Detroit. I'd do Southwestern Steel. Stop with you. You like you get some battle. Amen. He said, I turned down some folk for some weeping, Ezekiel. But they're not weeping for us down here. They're weeping for Tamar and some idols. They got a little thing that they're weeping about. But you know, really, when they come to church, they don't want to uh, show for the fact that they came for the habit. But when they go home in them, when they sit at their dinner table, you can hear them when they're with their relatives. They're weeping about what's going on inside them. Oh, you know, Brother Henry, so hard, you know. Thank you. Oh, now. Let judge me wrong. Let judge me wrong. You preach like that, I'm going to leave. Thank you. You already go. Amen. 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 You have to let physically. Amen. 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 Then said he unto me, some folks are really weeping around. Amen. 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 I'm going to show you some words today. And he brought me into the inner court of the Lord's house. And behold, at the door of the temple of the Lord, between the porch and the altar, were about five and twenty men with their backs toward the temple. Think about it. They turned their backs toward the temple and had their faces toward the east. They worshiped the sun. That's sad. They had their eyes with some black, white, glittery, some people other. But their back was toward the, the temple. They should have been full of light inside. But they was dark and cold and dead inside. Because I want you to see something. Now remember, we're looking at people's hearts here. Now this is not literal. This didn't have to take place literally. Yes, he had a literal vision. But well, you're looking at this man's heart. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. That's the point I'm trying to make is you can come to church and your heart go back to toward church for the roof. Come on. You'll be weeping about this and that and the other and come to church and your back turned toward the roof. You can raise your hand, shout, sing, do the whole nine yards, but your back is still going to be closed. Come on, they're going to look good on the inside, on the outside, brother. But God's going to show you what they really like. Come on, I'm going to show you a difference between these people. Over right here, we're gonna we over Tamar. Okay. We're gonna over the flesh. We're gonna over here because they can't have the time man. They sit back and wish they wasn't what they are now. They're hoping that someday, brother, happy, brother, Cain will let down. So they can take over. Come on, 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 So folks, that, listen, you, you backslide a long time before you ever leave the building. You got your back turned a long time before you ever go. What you weeping about? That's why it turned your back to me. It's too hard. It's too hard. I'm going to be too hard now, boy. That's 
that true? Can't get out. They had the back toward the temple. Already gone. Amen. Now what's the reason why you been in, in in case you didn't know the title is why we was that? Why we was that? Now if you're not weeping over that, you're weeping over something. Amen. Amen. Oh, yeah. Weeping over something. Why you weeping over something? Why you here? That's right. Amen. Some folks, some folks, listen, some people are brought to tears because they can't have their own way. They are brought to tears because they can't have it the way they want. If it's anything, if it's, if it's any deviation from the way they decide, they'll bring them to tears. They'll be crying about it today. They may stay home with you, sir. Why do you say you're special? Bring your testimony. Oh, I'm alright, I'm alright. You get it home with you. You can't have your way. You call the song somebody else called the song. Your song not sung. You messed up. Yes, it is, Father. Yes, it is. Awesome. Hey. Well, that's right. People won't log in for you to see me. Now, what is that you we be over this morning? Why out? Dying is in a pitiful predicament. And it's getting worse. Folks are yeah. writing books and rooms out well off there. Yeah. <laughs> How do you know? It should be evident that we don't have what we need in general. Well, amen. 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 And we need power. But they didn't just write books about how much power we got, trying to prove we got it. Oh, that's us. People writing books and getting on. Don't prove all that miracles and whatnot. How they got any power. Amen. Now look, when we go to these meetings, when you hear people talk about the standards too high and you're fanatic and you not, you you preaching too hard, what do you think they do? They're weeping for ten years. They're weeping! They put some women. They put some prideful strength. Amen. Amen. What everybody pertains to. All oh, that's, that's not necessary. Oh, it's too much bad. Don't, don't read your bad. I think y'all be able to uh, drink coffee and drink water and, and eat when you fast and everything. That's no fast. Well, that's right. Fast when you don't eat. You don't drink. You don't need no coffee no way. Look at your handshake. Amen. I got under control. You ain't got under control. You ain't right. You're not right. You just you had your cup. You might ready to get a cup, but I won't be the kind of going. Yeah, it might be no cup. Yeah, I'll be ready to get a cup. I'll be ready to get a cup. But they have to be fast for years. They have to be fast for years. I'm telling you, they have fast, after they have fast three years. And if you can see them, they don't fast man, they don't offend them. Yeah. Yeah. You know, they don't get mad about it. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Amen. Yeah. 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 Come on. Folks, listen, folks around is, is crying out for all kinds of things. Lord help us. Yeah. We, we should be more concerned about the state of a man than the church, that we all about our own affairs. Yeah. And to bring up the poverty. Yeah. We don't want everybody bring us to. Oh, that's right. That's it, brother. That's the truth. Amen. Boy, we might all be now, for Amen. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Some folks have doubts in their hearts. Mm. Amen. Yeah. And listen, friend, if you're not saved this morning, Lord, you are not doubtful. Yep, Lord. Yep, Lord. I don't say that. I don't say that disrespectfully. We all were. We're not going to see the worship of God. That's what it is. Okay. Yeah. Okay. There's no two ways about it. 
And if you're not saved this morning, there's something you're weak and uh, desire more than you desire God. Well, that's if right. you want, you have God. And right. he said, I'm available to you. I'm not at hand. He's at the door. All you have to do is make that. But there's something that you want more than you want. Yeah. That's right. why you are what you are. That's right. That's right. That don't follow. Folks who are not sacrificed better on the church for 10 years, that's the reason why you're not sacrificed. Amen. 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 That's something you've been weeping after the last year. Right. That's why you can't get down to business. Yeah. That's something you want more than you want back to catch. Yeah. And by the time you come to get after 10 years, you're probably not ready for it. You might have to start all over with the foundation of it. Come on. Just start the groundwork one. Just get saved. You got to sit around and ready for 10 to 15 years. Yeah, even five years. Yeah, even two years. Hardly one year without going all the way. That's right. That's right. That judgment road, brother. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 Oh, Thank you. Too That's why you can't go all the way. Weeping and crying over the flesh. I can't stay all the way. I can't do that. I can't do that. No. Got to be saved. Stay out all night. I'm saved. Thank you. That's right. That's right. That's right. Spiritual. Amen. Come over here to number the other chapter. You know what it is. I just got to scrub the pure mind by way of this. Paul. There needs to be some real weeping on the altar. That's what we need. Amen. Some folks getting some real victory. That's what we need. That's right. Not just coming up the same word. I'm talking about getting down to business. That's right. I'm done. I'm through. I'm making a break. Well, that's right. Yes, if people would spend more time praying about their own personal problems, yeah, that's right. Who more, uh, spend more time about praying for themselves and weeping about themselves, we'd be much better off. Yeah. And I'm not talking about uh, 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 selfish. I'm talking about, Lord, you help me. Yeah. Lord, you strengthen me. Lord, Lord you bless me. Do something for me. Yeah. Help me be a blessing to receive me. Yeah. Make me something for you. Yeah. Lord, get me out of the way. Get me out of the way. Get me out of the way. Don't move me to happen. Help us to make it. That's right. Amen. Thank the Lord. We're going to be everything but that. Pray about everything but their own problems. Oh, that's brother to pray. That's brother to be. That's brother to What about you? Yeah, Lord, we'll talk to you. Pray about this because you have a problem with you. Lord, 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 bless so and so. Pray about yourself. That's Lord, right. Lord, bless so and so. Lord, look out the Lord. You weep and cry on it. What did Jesus say? Thank you. Right. He said, weep not for me. He said, weep for yourself before your children. Yeah. I just told you, I'm weeping you're talking about that. You got something to say. It's a good life. Thank you. Number 11 chapter. Let's look at some people here that just weep. Beginning at the 18th verse. Thanks. Oh, excuse me, the fourth verse, I'm sorry. And the mixed, number seven, four. And the mixed multitude was among them. That was among them. Fellow lusting. Folks still follow the lusting. Folks still follow the lusting. Amen. You can call it what you see, not the mind. But it's lusting as the left. Thank you. 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 Thank Amen. And the mixed multitude that was among them fell a lust. And the children of Israel also wept again. That's the first time they did it. They're doing it again. They're doing it again. Ah, some folks can't get no victory. They're doing it again. They, they get it and then they can't get all that back to again. Weeping for the rest of their lives. And, and said, who shall give us flesh to eat? Yeah. Oh, we're we, we about the flesh. Yeah. There's a whole lot more flesh to eat. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. We remember the fish which we did eat in Egypt free. <laughs> the cucumbers and the melons and the leeks and the onions and the garlic. But now our soul is dried away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got a right. Hey, we don't have a reason for it, right? There's nothing at all besides this matter before our eyes. When you come to the place where you are not satisfied with what God does for you, in a dangerous position. Amen? Amen. Now you will find yourself murmuring and complaining and doing all kinds of things. The Bible even said, why does a living man complain? Why? You're alive, aren't you? Why? 
Yeah. Even if you're not saved, if you got the worship predicament, you have nothing to complain about. Yeah. And may happy may grant you repentance. Yes, man. You keep all that weeping up, and sometimes when you do a spot of marketing, he might pass you by. That's yes, right. He likes, he likes the skating race. And he likes the drugs. Nope. Can't do it with you. Man, no. If you don't do it, he's weeping about it. Oh. He's fine when he don't get his way. He wants his girlfriend. You know, you can't do anything to eat. Amen. Sure. This is what it says here, verse 13. When should I have flesh to give all these people? When they weep on the thing. Saying, give us flesh that we may eat. Our question is, what you weeping for? Uh, but some things we don't we vote and some things we can't we vote. Mm -hmm. And there is a difference. Yes. Amen. And you can't we vote what you left behind. Amen. Mm -hmm. yeah. You cannot we vote what you left behind. If God has shown you to give it up, send it up. And you give it up, and there's no need to we vote. Amen. No. No, 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 no. That means a lot of folks are talking about that. That's so true. I guess a lot of folks in trouble. You don't have to have no tears now. This is the attitude I'm talking about. That's right. Special mind runs way out of left field. I'm talking about the attitude. Man. You don't have to go home and be crying about it. That's so true. Got, I mean, little tears streaming down your face. And then what's the attitude that you hold? Whether you're weeping or not about it. No, that's right. That ain't bad. That's right. Come on. Some folks are still weeping about that. Still out of it in the spirit. Come on. When did they change the, the tenor of the service? Change the tempo of the song. Sing some different songs. I can remember one young person in Ohio, a great deal of ticket. And this young lady could not get the picture. Could not get the picture. Over oh, that was I know. There was just something in her. If she might be able to separate herself from the Lord, there was something in there. She didn't get the picture of a battle of music. Oh, gosh. You know what she is now? She's a battle. She probably wish she'd been longer than me, what she's been weeping about. Come on. You folks got our great cup, right? Say, please. Now that you assert that you got, our brother, our brother,
Judgment roll, brother. Glory to God. We're not supposed to be because of it. Now, I'd like to get the last word in the priest again. Thank the Lord. That's why you'll be on the street if you have that last word. Man. That's it. You'll get the place where you can't help with that last word. You'll get the place where you really didn't have to have it. All right. What are you saying? I lost. Think of yourself. Last word, Spirit. Man. Thank you. That's the truth. Thank you, Lord. 
Amen. 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 Amen.
Well, that's right. Thank you. Lord, help us. Please. Amen. Well, you can come around there. Yeah, I know. You know. You know, girl, too. I think I can witness to her. You know what? You were sitting down watching TV with her. You know, you were sitting down watching the tube with her. I knew about it. They didn't know. I'm doing all music because you didn't have one. Now you can't stop going on. Now they invite you over to the television. I hope you come by and see. My Lord. Good preaching. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord. Yeah, I'm going to go back to the minister. I'm going to go back to the minister. Let judgment roll, brother. Let it roll. We got family, I'm sure. When your family has done it later on, you can't decide. Amen. Amen. Look what we know in family. That's the truth. That's the truth. My sister. Okay, what you do is speaking to my children. Judgment roll, brother. Thank the Lord. Yeah. 
Neither thirst anymore. Souls have been satisfied. Souls have been satisfied. That's why they're not doing any weeping here. That soul satisfied. They've been weeping for nothing that satisfied. That's right. That's the truth. Flesh. That's the truth. You can read for your own way. Right, Lord. They no more. They don't thirst anymore. Neither shall the sunlight on them nor any heat. Don't look like he's not even fucking burning. No. 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 So we're not a preacher, they don't get offended. That's the truth. I said if they're told they're not a preacher, they don't get offended. That's the truth. Oh, brother, brother, I'm heading up on the floor. Brother, I don't see it. I don't see it. All right. No, we should. You'll call up. You'll stand up and announce it. Nobody else sees it. No one sees it. Except your family, dude. Thank you. Yeah, I do. It's good to go. For the Lamb which is in the midst of the world shall feed him. Well, he's not feeding the witness. He's got none of My Lord. And shall lead them unto living fountains of water. Ooh. This is what it says here. And God shall wipe away all their tears from their eyes. God doing some wiping here. That doesn't mean we're not going to be doing some crying, but it's what we're crying about the next minute. And the Bible did teach us that God will console us. But yeah. if something's here, also we'll never cry again if we stay safe. Yeah. You're not yeah. the cloud of a sinner again, brother. Why not a sinner anymore? Yeah. Praise God. We're going to sit and sit and we can tell you what we're going to do. This is the thing we've got to move over. Yeah. Yeah. This is the situation we're weeping on. Yeah. Right. But it's what you're weeping about. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. That's the truth. That's the truth. Amen. God is calling us to a higher life. Amen. You're not saying you know he wants you saved. Amen. If you have been saved, you know what it was like to be saved. That's right. Why didn't the position that you're in now? My Lord. Why, why continue on to the condition you're in for God to release you and release you? Oh, God. Why don't you come get this salvation? Well, it's good to pray. Those of you that have been weeping out the things of God has done, why don't you renew your covenant with the Holy Ghost? Yeah. yeah. Come on. Why do you think the Lord knows I've been doing some weeping over this? I've been acting like Balaam sometimes. You told me no, but I went back and prayed again. By the time I got through praying, Lord, I didn't have enough sick. I was as bad off as that ass was. And you had to do everything you did to try to prick me and turn it around. But Lord, you remember this morning. You told me something this morning. You've been laughing. And I didn't see it. I don't ever see the reload that again. Well, that's right. Give it up now. That's right. Don't worry about me being fitted here, acting ugly and getting mean and being touched. I can just tell you everything I'm done with. I won't go away offended. I'm not going away to bring my shoulder, my feelings on my shoulder, Lord. I'm done with it. Thank you, Lord. Thank I'm not going to talk about the saints. Lord, I'm through. Thank you, Lord. I won't fight the message. I won't argue the message. I'll read my Bible and pray about it. I don't want the Lord to speak when I'm tired. It's wearing me out. Thank the Lord. I won't be like David. Don't say it. Thank the Lord. Got it clear in my hands. Now, you're not going to be able to go out to the fellowship meeting and run down and jump. Jump over his shoes. That's the truth. Amen. You're not going to make a decision. That's right. You, you, you are growing and... I'll be one of them. This message comes with a lot of brown this morning. That's the truth. Amen. You might rejoice because you're not the only one, but what about the other place? Thank the Lord. You know, you're going to have to have a last word. Amen. I know everybody, when you try to count people, you know, I have a count of meeting, I talk to people. Oh, my Lord. Oh, my God, have a love. My Lord. Now, the flesh right now, you know that the Lord and all of them get the great big hand to see you. To kiss it. And then pray on Amen. Um. You know they want to say, "Tell them what they want to save now." And back up on God because he want to enjoy the flesh, but it's going to run out. It's going to run out of the loop one day. 
Brother, they're gonna run out their nostril one of these days. I'm telling you, you better pray, you better pray hard. We, if, if some people pray hard now, you wouldn't have to pray hard afterwards. That's the sure. truth. If you weep out some things right now and get the mind of God, you wouldn't have to weep so hard after you get in trouble. Amen! That's Amen. the truth. That's right. And I need to wait to see how your friend's gonna respond to the message. You God. You wait to see what somebody else is going to do, who you think is spiritual, and they're doing it, see what they're going to do about it. Thank God, you made your mind, God, why you clear. Right. You move while it's clear in your eyes. That's the truth. Thank the Lord. You know, you don't know, there are a lot of people, they want sick of the flesh right now. Yeah. Give yourself this ash and then you close it, that, that, the other. When you got to get cancer and you're wasting away, your wardrobe will going to look obnoxious to you. Right. right now, you can't get spiritual because of it. Many of these things right now, praise that of God, that you can't get victory over, amen, that uh, pulling you down and you just got to have. I'm going to tell you, you can get in a predicament, you don't want you don't even want to see it. Uh, yeah. man one time was climbing for money, just you had us do a big, big, big money and everything, because he got cancer. Right? And the wife, all we had to pay, we make a lot of money, don't even tell me about it. Running out his nostrils. Oh, get his life. Amen. This is the thing right now, they want to go be trying to gear to a spirituality, get them down to the end of the land, they never want to go to the flesh. That's the truth. Amen. Trying to draw attention to ourselves. Uh, we enjoy our mind with lightness. Don't think about things that are weighty anymore. Uh, Amen. Uh, like the brother said, God has convicted some of us about this music, but still won't push on over anyway. So I've been through some things and we went back and got it again. I'm going to clip all the cords for you, and now you got another stack bigger one here, Vicky. Come on. Don't you know who's going to change his mind? That's the truth. Come on. Amen. All the work is praise our God. I'm going to tell you something, dear one. If you really want to be blessed, I believe God sent this better just to prepare us for the fellowship. That's right. Amen. And if you go on and clear the way, praise our God, and get these things out of the way, rejoice. You can have true rejoicing. This will really be a blessing yourself. Thank you. Okay, but you can hide yourself and want to God. You know, many times you make declarations, public declarations about this thing, and amen about all this, read this kind of method, put it in this, and here, listen to this, and now you got it again, you can hide your heart if you want to. You need to get on the altar before God, the Lord, I'm coming to you this morning. No. I'm going to talk my heart this morning. Thank you. Amen. Thank you. Praise the Lord God. Thank you. I can't go to these scriptures, I know all about Rex Morgan in the front of people. Yeah. Go. Thank you. Go. Thank you. Thank God. God. Don't want to leave him with me. I don't want to leave box for it. Come on. Oh, Hold on. Thank you. Well, they want to tell you something. Praise the God. Many people didn't want to weep. Get out of bed from God and weep. Get the victory. But you weep in hell. That's the truth. That's the truth. Amen. We can hard now, hard now, but we're struggling. But all oh, one of these days. My God, one of these days. My Lord. We ought to weep while we for him. Let's weep a while weep will do us some good. Right. See, after a while, they want to thank God you can cry, you can cry too late. Amen. Praise our God. Amen. Amen. Thank God you get God going to slay this flesh and kill it old worldly minds with God. That's right. That's not 12 or 15 years. And praise our God, some of the same thing. Amen. God stood out I trust you said, you know, this morning. I trust God shook you this morning. I'm going to tell you something. Let's get a mark this morning. Let's go just go to the prayer of the office. Let's get a mark Let God mark us this morning. Thank you. Amen. Let God mark us. Let's give God give us a permanent mark this morning. Let uh, it brand us permanently. Oh, oh no. let me be one. You just got to have a little flesh every now and then. Step across the line and that's that is not that passion. No. That is not that appetite. Keep, keep victory two weeks at a time. My Lord. Oh, you're going to get sick of one of these brother. Man. You're going to get sick of yourself. They're going to become loop. It's going to become obnoxious to you. All thrill, if you get a sense of thrill, then you got to relieve yourself. But one day they're going to become obnoxious to you. You hear what I'm saying? It's going to become absolutely obnoxious. And a friend called me, you'd be saved. You know what I mean? You sit in the barbershop and talk, you know? Mm -hmm. you know I did that the other day. Man, you know what? I'm sick of that stuff now. I'm back in the night in the world, and I don't even want it. Uh, and I don't even go out for twice or one, I mean, one day or two weeks. I, I mean, I don't care about going out anymore. When I was saved, they'll give me the trouble, but I went back to it, and now I'm out here now, and I don't even want that. Now I'm not even thinking about that stuff. Isn't that pitiful? Yeah. Isn't that pitiful? Running out of not knock, now everything's going down. Flesh going to be going different, women going to be going different. Yeah, they can't bring them over with because they're killing everything else. Oh, God. Oh, isn't that sad? Oh, Lord. Isn't that sad? 
Brother, when the left try to show up the picture, he's sure going to be glory from the outside. That's right. Oh, you can't say, hey, I ain't got to worry about the breaking fast. You ain't got to worry about trying to go against the flesh anymore. You, got to, you don't have to worry about fighting the devil anymore. But all the different comments when you come out of the gospel, boy. When you get sick, when you're bumping, that's bad enough. But when you start coming out, you know you're best enough to show up. That's right. I mean, you're sick then. I mean, you're sick, you wish you could die then. All right. you sick. Thank God, the very thing that you don't want to get saved, brother. The very thing you're holding out, brother. The very thing you don't want to get sent to God, brother. The very thing you don't want to give up. Oh my God. Brother, you're going to be cutting up in your stomach after a while. Mm. I wouldn't say, but y'all, you all don't believe in this. That's why I don't want to get saved. That's you know, right. That's right. You know, they want, uh, my brother was telling me some years ago, priceless daughter in New York City was dying of cancer. And just to try to appease her, they would have a, one of the big fine uh, stores, Macy's, to bring a whole rack of of a spending five hundred dollar dress and just rule before. No. Let her look at those dresses. Trying to cheer up in her last day. No. I guess she's been buying all this thousand dollar gowns and all this kind of stuff. But but none of that mattered then. No, none of that mattered when you bring dresses and mink coats and everything else. Get that mess out of my face. No. I remember Clark Gable that I remember years ago, brother, women used to write a send new pictures to him all over the world and kill him. I mean, buy it and get it more than he wanted to work. Uh, but I remember when he got 19, about 96, brother, when he got cancer. And his body started waiting for his brother. All the pin up women, all the fine women, the brother. Very quiet to know. You might not want to see it, you might not want to think about it, brother. But I wish you take a warning this morning. Sure. I wish you take heed this morning. My God, I wish you take heed. Oh, thank, thank God that you just can't give up. I ain't ready yet. You'll be ready then. That's oh, I can't even be ready then. That's but God right. might not be ready. That's the truth. You'll be ready then, but God might not be ready. Give it up now. Give it up while you can. Tell it up while you can. Let me show you something. Well, don't you think if you tell me something, bro, you think you're gonna die? That's right. Because otherwise, this called life is there for you. Something has to take place within you. That's right. See, then God can respond to that. Mm. Amen. What the brother preached this morning might be near and dear to you. It might be close to you. But give it up. Turn it loose. Yeah. Turn it loose and you can rejoice. They grieve my heart. They want them to be examples of the old saints of God. The brother come preach about all this mess. And we still hold on to it. He, well, he think that we're happy. I got that with us. Come on. Come on. I can read this place. I've been hiding down here. I got that. I've been reading all my. Give it to me. Read all my. Give it to me. 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 Let God break your feet on the water shop. Let God put a mark on you. That's right. Amen. He'll do it. Please have a God. I'm going to tell you something they want. When God begins to try to dig us out, when God is trying to dig us out, if you don't accept it then, you won't be dug out later. That's it. You won't be dug out later when God's trying to dig you out. When God bring it home to you, you say, well, I've been convicted before. I mean, I've heard it before, and I just waited a few days in the war. In fact, you might even get some judgment, though. Oh, God. You'll need, you'll need to reclaim it in the judgment, praise the love of God. That's you may want to decide if you're going to be spiritual, that's something you got to give it up. That's, that's something you got to give up. You're not going to be spiritual over it. You will deceive yourself. You're not going to be spiritual over it. That's and the truth. That's all, that's all there is to it. Now, if you fought with it, struggled with it, striven with it, and have not gotten success yet, let's do it now. Right. Let's do it now. What we can pray for you. Right. Amen. Leave it on the altar. Don't take it back with you. Let God give you a mark. You know what you're here for? And when you know you left it on the altar, it ain't going away to God. Not part of it, but all of it. Not part of it, but all of it. Amen. 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 Let's leave it. It might, you might have messed around with it so long now, it might be extremely difficult. No, but God. that's just the price you've got to pay. That's the reason. If you had given it up on the first place, you might have to do it. Uh, if, you had, if you had given it up the first, you wouldn't have to worry about it. That's now you mess around letting it leave it second.